I like to know things. Have you ever had a hard time getting your kids to eat fruits and vegetables? Especially nowadays when every, it seems like every other commercial is McDonald's, KFC, you know, I mean, fast food restaurant commercials are just all over the television. So this next study is for you. So this study is from the Times and it talks about kids that participated in gardening for 12 weeks actually doubled their intake of fruits and vegetables. And it says that they grew strawberries, herbs, potatoes, corn, peas, beans, squash, cantaloupe. I mean, they just kind of basically grew anything and everything. And their serving intake went from 1.9 servings to 4.5 servings. So that they actually more than doubled their serving intake. And actually, I have a garden at home and some of my favorite things to grow, uh, I have some red bell peppers, habanero peppers, I love spicy food. Uh, and then I also have an herb garden and lots of tomatoes. And it is the coolest thing to water these plants and all of a sudden see this, you know, see them bud, these vegetables and these colorful fruits. It's just, it's really great. So um, this is just a study showing that when kids are able to participate in something, where they can see the growth and see, you know, this leaf turn into this flower, which turns into this fruit, turns into this vegetable. I think it gets them into uh, what a vegetable and what a fruit is, and then I think they're more likely to eat it. Um, and then something else cool that the study says is that the 99 children that were aged 10 to 13 um, so that is a really difficult age, you know, the 10 to 13 year olds, um, they're kind of pre-teenager, they know what they want and, um, you know, they're quick to, to say what they want to eat and where they want to eat and um, so I think it's really neat that even this age group participated in the gardening and then still had awesome results and increased their intake. So that was this week's health news. And I want to end this message by saying that what you eat does affect your health. And, you know, it has an effect on various ways. It will affect how you feel. Um, it will affect your mood. It will affect your weight patterns, um, what you eat, why you eat, how you eat, how much you eat, you know, all these different things. So the, the brief message here is just if you improve your diet, you'll improve your health. See you next time.